I'm laughing because I was, I was watching uh, one of the stray cats in our neighborhood. Her, I've named her Snow White, and I saw her walking down the other way, down the street. And for some reason, that always makes me laugh, because the cats are just so cool. So it's been a minute since I have done a walk. A video walk. <laughs> oh, can you hear the doggies barking? Yeah. Yeah, we've got dogs across the street who are definite barkers, meaning like where they will bark for long periods of time. <laughs> yeah, especially if there's another dog walking by. And then the cats just sit there and wonder, why are they barking? <laughs> The difference between cat and dog behavior to me is really interesting. I grew up with cats, so I am naturally a cat person. But I also had a dog um, for a little while after my husband and I got married. Okay. I see why the dogs are barking, because there's another dog walker. <laughs> okay, I'm back. <laughs> so how are you doing today? What is the weather like by where you live? Today we have overcast skies. You can see. And it's chilly. That's because we had a really big storm. Basic... Uh, system come through we got some rain but it kind of went around where i live rather than through where i live <laughs> which was good crazy skies lots of lightning but anyway so today it's much cooler it's in the 60s yesterday we had a high of 80 so big difference in uh, temperature that's for sure and I have on several layers. I've got a tank, uh, a knit top, plus I have another jacket on top of that with a scarf and my cap hat. <laughs> yeah, so I'm reasonably warm. That works. More doggy barking. We have a cat, a stray cat, who comes to eat at our house and this cat <laughs> has got a meow on it like you wouldn't believe I mean just it meows and meows and meows and meows until you finally feed it we finally figured out that it's a boy <laughs> and I've decided to call him Tony the Tiger <laughs> Tiger striped, very assertive, not afraid to ask for what it wants. And the other boy cat that comes around regularly that we've had since he was little, his name is Shadow. And <laughs> he's been harassing the heck out of Tony the Tiger. Yes. And Tony is not having any of it. He's been fighting back. And the bigger he gets, the more fight he'll have, I'm sure. He's probably about, hmm, don't know if he's quite six months old yet. He's one of the littles of uh, Smoky Mama, who is uh, a regular around here. And we think she might be pregnant again. Mm. Yep. So we'll see how that goes. They always get very protective of themselves when they're, when they're uh, you know, expecting. More so than usual. And then she looks a little rounder <laughs> around the middle. So, yeah, you can kind of see what's going on. Yep. So, anyway. So that's what's been happening with the cats. I haven't been posting videos about the cats because... Uh, we were having some issues with cats spraying 
and we have had to change how we feed them. Instead of leaving dishes out full of food, we've had to put the food out just on the sidewalk further away from the house. Like, you know, you have to kind of zoom in on the camera to really see them uh, because the further away we do it, the less apt we'll have spraying to defend territory. We have a couple of cats in the neighborhood, boy cats in the neighborhood. Um, there's Big Blue and then there's, uh, what's the other one called? Shorty. Yeah. We call him Shorty because he looks a lot like another cat that used to be in the neighborhood that we haven't seen in a really long time. Big Tom. And they look like they could be brothers or that he could be like maybe an offspring of Tom, but he's not as tall. <laughs> so my husband named him Shorty. <laughs> yeah, that's how we got his name. But the two of them are definite sprayers. So every time they come around, we have to chase them away. Otherwise they get smelly. <laughs> yeah. And it got really bad for a while, but we seem to have gotten the situation under control. So we're good. So we still feed Moki Mama, uh, the two kittens, and uh, Shadow when he comes around. And we still have um, Mama Oreo. She was the first uh, mama cat who came around presenting her kittens to us on the front porch of our house when we first moved here. So she's a very stately cat and we love her and she's beautiful. She's a tuxedo cat, but she just has a way about her that's just very almost regal. You know, the way she holds herself. Yep. So that's my cat update for you. Just say goodbye for now. Have a delightful day.